So today, to be a great marketer, you have to be a digital marketer. And being a digital marketer means being a marketing engineer. Does that mean you have to be a programmer or an actual engineer? No. What it really means is you have to ask one simple question all the time. And then what? I'll give you some examples. Let's say a user sees a banner ad and they click. Okay, and then what? Well, then they hit a landing page. Okay, and then what? Well, then they fill out a form. Now, this is where people's brains tend to stop. They're like, I got someone to fill out a form. They became a lead. But in reality, that's where you're starting the relationship with that particular consumer. And you have to think about all those steps in between that point and the point that become, they become a customer. So let's explore some more of those steps. So they filled out the form. Okay, and then what? Well, then they hit a thank you page. Now, very often you see a thank you page um, and it'll be blank. It'll say, thank you, we'll get back to you soon. That's basically saying, thank you, you can go now. Instead of that, have more navigation on that page. Maybe have a video. Maybe have more product information. Maybe have a phone number and get them to call instead of you chasing them around. So change your thank you pages into engagement pages. Okay, and then what? Well, maybe your system will kick out an auto-reply email or a triggered email, and that hits their inbox. Okay, and then what? Well, then that lead goes into your CRM system. We also set a cookie on their browser. Okay, and then what? Well, then maybe remarketing is gonna follow them around the web, showing them banners and different display ads and things like that, trying to get them to come back, trying to escalate them through the sales process. Okay, then what? Well, then a salesperson picks up the phone and calls them. Okay, and then what? Well, maybe in Eloqua or Marketo or whatever your marketing automation system is, you might trigger a few emails and take them down a nurture path. Okay, then what? Well, then they convert. And all that information is tabulated in your tracking reporting system and you look at that and you learn what worked and what didn't work. Okay, and then what? Well then you optimize your campaign. So you really have to be always asking that question, and then what, and then what, and then what? Now, that's not gonna make you a marketing engineer overnight, but by asking and then what, it will force you to understand all of the technologies and all the tactics that create that customer journey. And when you get your head around that whole customer journey, you will be a marketing engineer.